just slammed me. So we've got basically four turns. Look, Shiny, Scarlet Man prepared you for this. Just find a way to get to Jefferson. Stop right you. We can. Ha <laughs> Bam. That opens the door. Dreamweaver. New great engineer tick tech Dreamweaver. Nice. pick it up. The fog extinguisher. Yeah, nice. I think I should have built the fog extinguisher. <laughs> Get everyone. My name is Fox Blockhead. Welcome back to another episode of the Ether Light. I just saw something there. I did see something there. And we are still downstairs. We're still trying to work this out. Um, after the last episode, I did actually make some... Where are they? Ah, uh, here. I made some fog extinguishers. Fog fire problem. And then I, I followed the... Uh, I followed the red string, like we were doing last episode, to this area. And, uh, and there's something... There's something here. We're using our fog powers of... Oh, 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 I saw it. Using our fog powers of deduction. Yeah, look at that. What have we found? Oh, is that a loaf of bread? It's a bread maker. Here's the hypothesis. <laughs> okay. They have highly tuned temperature regulators, didn't Let's you know? Of course, that makes perfect sense. I'll incorporate one into my design. Your design of what? Find two more clues using the Dreamweaver. I've got one. Uh, oh, frozen goggles. Hey, nice. And 750 XP. I like that. Um, the grease pits. Melt, uh, solve this. Oh, that's right. So we're solving the meltdown puzzle. Okay. Uh, so that is one piece of the puzzle solved. I get. Oh, there's another thing on the ground. Pick that up. Can never have too many. Oh, is there anything down this way? There's not. Uh, can never have too many bits and pieces lying around. Ooh. Bonus powers for automatons. Um, we've got oil on the ground. I don't know if that's good or bad. So yeah, I followed this uh, this red rope thing, and we don't want to get in any fights now if we can avoid it. I like to just uh, get in and do what we're here to do. So we'll go over to the other side where we started. Uh, where we're, sorry, where, where we finished last episode. Uh, that I think is where I was. Let's run around the monkey. The grease monkey, banana on the ground, boop, good, a little bit of ether, always helps, and hopefully there's no monkeys up this way, follow the red, the red string, oh there goes one grease monkey, and was it this way, uh, I think it was, I think it was down that way, that's, whoa, grease monkey, okay let's see if I can dodge, this automaton... Ah, I can't dodge him. Okay, be right back. Alrighty, there we go. Two grease monkeys and a troubleshooter. Oh, and three stars. Look at that. Can we collect some tin cans? Ah, just a whole bunch of oil. <laughs> That's alright. If I ever need oil, I know where to come, because these guys have got tons of oil. Oh, it's just beeped on the hour. We'll get this done. There we go. Alrighty, so here we go into Ch Chem. Chem bunker, and that is where we need. This is where we need them. So let's get our firefighting apparatus out. E, good stuff. If you ever need to put out a fire, have got anything? Oh, I can see it. There it is. Look at that. Let's see if there's anything else that we can see. Fox Blockhead went to CCC, but all that he could CCC was the bottom of the deep blue fire. I can't put that out. So I made eight of them, and I only needed one. Okay, what have we got? A poison detector. All right. All right. Poison detectors need to take some pretty precise readings. I can use that in my design. Uh, I think that's all we need now. Come back quickly. Meet Jefferson back at his cell. Righty yo, so let's do it. Let's let's run back. Hopefully I need those extinguishers. <laughs> uh, hopefully I need those extinguishers somewhere because I made eight of them. 
I hope that wasn't a waste. Okay, let's run back to Jefferson. Hopefully dodge the monkeys. Go, 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 go. Yes. I fought some monkeys while I was uh, making some things and, and making my way back. Now, 2187, that was my cell. And Jefferson's cell is... Oh, did that monkey just appear? This one. 3920. Pretty sure that's Jefferson's. Because my one was the one with the door all blown out. Yes, here we go. Okay, Jefferson, let's see what you've got. Well, I've got a toaster. Exactly what you thought. What are you doing? So I can compile this. These will polymerize. One more adjustment. Oh. Oh, okay. Uh-huh. Yes. Right, you'll need this. What have I got? A heat detector. Okay. All right. Heat detector. Now head out into the tunnels and try to find the heat source behind this mess. Oh, of course, because it's all melting down, isn't it? Okay, find the heat source in the grease pits. Do we do this? How do we find a heat source? Have we got... Oh, we got... Where's the heat... Oh, we'll have to go at the start. Let's see if there's a... Something. Oh, there it is. And... Heat detector. Switched on kind of guy. Okay. Let's turn up the heat then. Let's go. Alright. How do we use it? How do we use it? Can anyone hear anything? If we... No. I don't think... I don't think I can hear anything. But uh, this probably isn't the way because this is the uh, this is the the red string way. More red string. Yeah, this was the way to the other. Well, monkey. Uh, so I won't be back that way. Pick this up off the ground. So how do we? How do we use the heat detector? Let's run around the monkey. Monkey see oh hang on. There's a, a way over here. Oh no, I went that that way. I think. Um Oh the mission board. Oh, it's the way out. Excellent. I don't I don't really want to go out now, but no missions available. Hey! And that's our way to the North Surreys. Well, we really need to find... Huh. Well, that's cool. Found my way out. Now, how do we use this heat detector? Oh, monkey. I don't mind fighting the monkeys. They're not that difficult if you, uh, if you hit your specials. But in terms of taking the time out of the episode, I'd rather just skip them. So, two or oh, Technomite troubleshooter. Alright, see you when the battle's over. Okay, they're done. That one actually took a bit longer than I expected. Still got three stars though. Well, that's lovely. Thank you very much. I'll do with the watering can. Yep, kill, kill, kill. Since I used all my watering cans for the uh, the fire extinguishers. Ba, ba, ba. Okay, which way was I headed? Now, how do we... Let's go back to the start. How do we... Uh, is that... That's a teapot. So how do we do this? How do we use it? Oh, hang on. Those were some... Those were some, uh... Some loops on the roof. We use it on there. We use it on here. We use it on here. Use it on here. We use it on a monkey. Where do we? Oh, someone dodge past the yes. Dodge past the monkey. Dodge past the monkey. And oh, look, there's some loops. No. What about this? No. No. Okay. Run, run, run. 
that was the chemical plant that I was at before. Okay, so we go past that. And this. Can we do anything? Okay, another battle. No worries. See you in a minute. Alright, that was pretty simple, having just the two of them, but only two. That's fine. That's fine. We've got some gears and some some poles. Okay, so maybe... Maybe it almost let me... No! Oh, monkeys. Alright, second battle. Here we go. Here we go. See you later, Grease Monkey. Boom, boom. Alright, I am liking that uh, nail gun. It's another three. Okay, what have we got? A screw good. Two tin cans and a bucket of water. Excellent. I like it when you pick up those random things that you actually want. It actually makes it, makes it good. Okay, now I was actually thinking... Let's go back to the start. If I tap it on here. No, can't do that. Can't do that. Can we do it here? No, here. I've got to find something that I can actually tap it on. Hmm. Something that I, I can actually reach. Now, where did you go? There was a piece of red, red felt there earlier. That was uh, a bit of a direction beacon for me. Maybe, whoop, duck around him. Maybe it's moved. Oh, so I've got to go this way. Might have to take on. Oh, here we go. Monkey, can you see me? Monkey, see me? And dodge him, dodge him, dodge him. Yep, good stuff. And follow the red ribbon. That's what I did earlier. And red ribbon. Oh, 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 the postman. Okay. <laughs> yes, you almost ran into me down in the sewers. What are you looking at? Uh, wait, is that a dream weaver? I've been wanting to take a look at one of those. Well, you can't. It's mine. <laughs> uh, I th there's things it can uncover all over with Asia. Well, I'm hoping so. Help me discover where the great engineer is. Don't let me slow you down. There's a lot more to discover. There sure is a lot more to discover. Okay, let's see. What's down this way? Aha. Uh -huh. No. No. Maybe this way. Let's keep going. Um, no. So what's down here? Oh, no, hang on. Let's use the Dreamweaver. Yeah, look at this. Look at this. Do we have to... Oh! Oh! I was not expecting that. <laughs> I was not expecting that. Oh my goodness, that was <laughs> very, very unexpected. Whew. Okay, so there is a way in over there now. So I think the grease vat. Let's save that for next episode, shall we? Oh my goodness, my heart is racing. I just whacked the microphone. Oh, okay. Well, thanks very much for watching. Uh, oh, we did. We actually used that thing to find and detonate the ice. Alright, so, next episode, the grease vat. Let's solve this. That's going to be the heat, so heat source. I've never had an That's going to be the heat source. Alright, thanks very much for watching. This has been the Ether Light. We are over 50 episodes now. Can you believe that? Wow. Alright, until next time, I'll see you later, alligators.